Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, my name is Gabriella. I hope that you're all doing well. In today's video, I'm doing a sketchbook spread depicting two wild boars in my art creation sketchbook using Artgraph VRCO tailor shaped blocks. I'm only using the earth colors and the black and white blocks. Plus, I will be adding one watercolor to boost the saturation. This year, I'm really trying to appreciate all the art supplies that I've already had for a while. And I've been discovering slash rediscovering a lot of cool art supplies. About the Artgraph VR code blocks in particular, I've been on the fence for a long time. I can't really decide if I like them or not still. I don't really reach for them to be honest, but I'm trying to make it work. The paint that I'm holding right now is actually Canacrodon Burnt Orange by Daniel Smith that I, for whatever reason, squeezed into this empty Gonzai pen. The reason why I decided to add it is because I needed a color that was more vibrant than the blocks, but still fit the earthy color theme. It ended up being a very good decision. I think this Queen Burnt Orange was a great addition and really improved the color palette. The blocks, being an opaque, chalky medium and also consisting of multiple pigments each, don't really mix well in my opinion. But if you add just one vibrant color to complement them, they will look a ton better. That said, the painting will first have to go through a really ugly phase in the beginning. This is the first time that I'm using Artgraph blocks on the Art Creations sketchbook paper, and it took me a couple of minutes to get the hang of it, as they really behaved very differently to watercolors, but then it finally came together in the end. I will do about three layers with the blocks, and then I will switch to color pencils to add in some details and some extra texture. As for the image, I love boar pigs and I do draw them every now and then. The reference picture is from Pixabay and it will be available in the description in case you also decide to paint the same photo. Other than that, I don't have much to add to this video, so I will stop talking now, I'll put on some music and I will see you at the end of the video.
So here's the finished piece. I really like it, especially how the Conacredon burnt orange is glowing in the sunlight. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment. Thank you for watching this to the end. Take care and see you next time. Bye!